Entrevistas Farmacia Hospitalaria. Volumen 48, número 2. Instrumentos validados de desprescripción de medicamentos para los pacientes con necesidades de cuidados paliativos. Una revisión sistemática. ¿Cuál es el principal objetivo de su trabajo o estudio? So, our study aims to identify validated instruments from the prescribing appropriate medications in patients with palliative care needs and to assess the impact on clinical and economic outcomes. ¿Cuáles son los principales resultados obtenidos? From the more than 5,000 studies retrieved in your systematic review, only one study meets the increasing criteria. In this study, the prescribing is performed using a specific tool. The mean number of inappropriate medication and monthly medication costs were significantly lower in the intervention group. However, there are no statistically significant differences in the unscheduled hospital presentation, falls, fractures, mortality, or quarterly of life. What is the aportation of your study to the practical clinic? According to the math we adopt in our review and consider the identified limitations, our study suggests that all survival instruments are available to support the prescribing in patients with palliative care needs. Only one has been validated and evaluated for effectiveness in clinical practice. The impact on patient safety and the humanistic outcomes remain unclear. We highlight the need for more high-quality studies to evaluate the effects of the prescribing using validated instruments for patients with palliative care needs. Regardless of their willingness, frailty, or age group. ¿Qué tres puntos destacaría de su investigación? There are few studies involving patients with palliative care needs that have assessed the impact of the prescribing on clinical and humanistic outcomes using validating instruments. And as demonstrated in the included study, reduced the number of inappropriate medication prescribing and lowered the monthly cost of pharmacotherapy for patients with palliative care needs. However, the impact on patient safety and the humanistic outcomes, such as a quality of life, remain unclear. The crucial need for high-quality studies to assess the impact of the prescribing appropriate medication use a validating instrument in this population, regardless of willingness or age group. 